Hey, it's Chuck Karstensen, Remax Results, with this month's market update video for you. So we're going to continue with the similar theme to the other videos, which is the market is, is tight for buyers. There's not that many homes out, especially if, say, you're a first-time home buyer or in most areas in, you know, 200, 250,000 and under price range. You go out there and try to make an offer. There's going to be multiple offers. And we're finding that it takes a lot of buyers three, four, five offers before they get an offer accepted because it's a process of learning that the listing price may not be the selling price. It may actually be higher. You know, if you thought about this in real estate before, and a lot of people I still meet with now, they assume that, okay, if you got a listing up here that you offer way less, then that's what you offer. On those type of listings, that doesn't work anymore. You have to actually offer over the price and you have to maybe negotiate some of the terms like be flexible to the closing date of the seller. Um, a lot of buyers think, hey, I get my closing costs paid for by the seller. Sometimes you have to say no to closing costs and just, just be ready to pay those yourself in the competitive price range. Certainly upper, upper bracket homes, it's more of a normal market where we do see offers that come in under listing price. But in general, with the low inventory, the market's hopping, we need more sellers. So I've had sellers or past customers of mine I've reached out to, and hey, who you know that's looking to buy or sell a property, a neighbor, a coworker, just because we need more listings, especially in that, you know, maybe first time home buyer range or investor range. So again, the theme's the same, the market's hot, prices have been coming up, interest rates are still generally low, so comparing rent to buying, that's why that market's hot because you're probably getting a lower house payment. You can get in the house for low down. So people still want to buy, they want to be stable. That's the dream home ownership. Is the market going to shift much in the next few months? Well, there's more demand for housing than listings. So I think we've got a few more strong, strong months where it's going to be very competitive for the listing. So if you're looking to buy, you gotta be prepared for that. If you're thinking about selling, it's really a good time to get it going because of the competitive nature of the market. Chuck Karstensen, Remax Results. Chuck and Michelle Karstensen team, brother-sister team, we're happy to help you. Please reach out to us if you can.